today on Cheese Rules, we are going to take a side road off the cheese highway. One of my passions is pairing spirits with artisanal cheeses. And I thought, oh, we could do tequila or single malt scotch whiskey or gin. But instead, I thought, let's do a single village mezcal. So I started exploring mezcals and found Del Maguey uh, mezcal that Ron Cooper, the famous artist, fell madly in love with. He was hiking and traveling in Mexico, way up in the mountains of Oaxaca. Each village makes a different mezcal, and most of those mezcals had never seen a bottle until Ron discovered them. I chose this particular village uh, because it had a very fruity, lightly smoked pear flavor profiles coming through. And I decided to pair it with the Sartori family's Dulcina Gorgonzola. This is a very mild, creamy Gorgonzola. It's got a sweet finish and just a light, light, light smoke flavor. It's not smoke, but somehow it comes through. And it's just like a great relationship. You know, you fall in love and one plus one equals more than two. And in this case, to the moon. It's just an amazing pairing. So I think I'll show you how to drink this. Ron sent us these beautiful traditional handmade tasting cups. And this is not a mescal with the worm in it. Worm free. That's industrial rot gut, I guess I would call it. It's frightening. This is sipping. And just as the cheese, you don't throw down the whole wheel. You just take a little bite. Make a cheese highway on your tongue. Mm. Chew it up, take a sip of your mescal. Oh. And normally with mescal, your face would change. You'd be all crinkled up. Instead, I'm smiling. It's just heavenly. The creaminess of the cheese, the fruitiness of the cheese really is coming through. I feel like I'm running through the rainforest up in the Oaxacan hills eating gorgonzola cheese. Cheers. Enjoy, everybody. <laughs>